mowing is the most important and frequent task that needs to be undertaken. Mowing grass provides a surface with a uniform height of cut suitable for the type and level of sport to be played. Mowing can also control vegetation in a turf grass sward. By mowing correctly at the right height and frequency, turf grass will become finer and denser, providing a better surface for both the players and the ball. Denser turf will keep weeds at bay and the mowing height will limit the type of weeds you may get. Mowing too low or too high, mowing infrequently or scalping the plant will weaken the grass, which can potentially lead to damage from players and give weeds a better chance of getting a foothold in your pitch. A cylinder mower has a moving reel of blades which trap and then cut the grass against a bed knife or bottom blade using a scissor action, which cuts the grass very cleanly. Before mowing, carry out a full risk assessment and PPE check. Daily checks on the machine will include things like checking the fluid and fuel levels, tyres and ensuring guards are fitted. As each machine is different, consult the manufacturer's handbook for guidance. Check the height of cut on the machine. Don't remove more than a third of the grass leaf at any one time. You may need to mow higher than you want to to ensure the grass stays healthy and reduce the height slowly over a number of cuts. Check the reel of the mower passes correctly over the bottom blade. If the gap is too great, the grass will not be cut, and if the gap is too little and the reel is hitting the bed knife, damage to the machine will occur. Check the pitch surface for debris that may damage the machine, and begin mowing in a suitable pattern, trying to have a minimal overlap between mowing widths. Check the height of the first cut. If you are taking too much or too little off the grass, stop and adjust the height. If you are collecting clippings or boxing off, try to empty the box regularly so the weight of the grass clippings does not cause problems when lifting the box off or cause the mower to sink into the turf. If you leave it too late, you will see lines of grass clippings on the surface. When finished, clean the machine down and grease it up for next time.